I'm delighted to say I have the British women with me here, Emma Step 2 and Sonia Samuels. It's just so great to see you both smiling after that race because it's tough, isn't it, for you guys out there when the league pack goes away. You run a lot of that race on your own. Yeah, it is, but it's such a great place to run a marathon. I mean, my ears are buzzing, I don't know about yours, but it was just fantastic the support the whole way around. It was just brilliant. What does this mean about times for qualification for the World Championships later in the year? Are you going to another, run another marathon before then to try and get the qualification time? I'll see what happens and what the news is after this, but um, I prefer an autumn marathon anyway, so maybe I will, yes, if, if my legs forgive me in time. Just outside at the moment, agonisingly so, for you, are you thinking that you're going to have to race again? Um, I, I always plan to run an autumn marathon anyway if I didn't do the World Champs. Um, so I didn't do a marathon last year, so I felt like I just needed to get one going um, in the spring and then I'll look forward to an autumn marathon. All day, we're, we're just reminding people that if they're inspired, and how can you not be today? It's such an incredible event that it's never too late to start running, and you are the personification of that, an elite runner who didn't really start getting your running chops till you were 35. No, it's, it's thanks to joining the Athletics Club and, you know, seeing what people can do and getting real good coaching advice. So if anybody's thinking about it, it doesn't matter what level you're at, just have a go, start steady, get the right advice, and you, you will never regret it. You'll be amazed what you can actually achieve. So if I can do it, anybody can. And it's so lovely, Emma just said to me, how's Paula getting on? Because Paula Radcliffe is out there with the masses, with people dressed as dinosaurs and in high heels, and she's in the throng, and she's, you know, looking incredible, as always. But how, how important has she been, do you think, to women's distance running in this country? And we're today really celebrating an incredible career. I think she's inspired everyone. She's definitely inspired me, and I think, you know, just what she's achieved is just phenomenal. And, you know, we've got to aspire to uh, maybe not run 2.15, but, you know, try and run as best we can. So... It would appear that very few women could get close exactly. to 2.15. What an incredible world record that was. Ladies, thank you so much for letting you jog down, warm down, get warmed up, actually. It's not, it's not as warm as it has been in recent years. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you later. Nice to meet you.